Yeah, hey, dude. Douglas, how are you today? What good you to see you doing there? Good, good, dude. Man, well, you got you so bad. Don't, dude. I'm trying to film, make nice video. This is why my videos are always shaky because I'm constantly scared of you tickling me. <laughs> Stop it! <laughs> <laughs> quit it! Uh, quit it! You better Stop quit. This. What are you doing, dude? So yesterday, Rich and I were here. I did a bunch of stuff preparing for today. Today, I said, Doug, dude, please, dude, <laughs> Doug, please. <laughs> Build please. my motors, please. please. So yeah, Project 168, you guys saw this, uh, I don't know, a couple weeks ago. Yeah, a back. Big refresh yeah. on this sucker. So totally tore it down. Yep. We've got a lot of parts that are here for it already. We've got a lot of parts that are gonna be here like today, tomorrow, and this thing has to get back together uh, basically right away. Today's Monday, has to be done by Sunday. Yeah. Which can be done, but things are here, things are not here. Either way. We're gonna get it done. Anyways, we're starting now. Nick Seuss is putting on uh, some more lighting because yeah. where we're going, you need lighting. Key key to success out there is the lights. Leo knows. Yeah, big yeah, lighting so guy. Not only are we at Project 168, but we're about to go to Project 268. Let's see it. Let's see All right, it. Ready? Yeah. All right, Doug, you ready? I can see, man. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, all right so he's putting some baja designs pods on right now i'm gonna go to the back of the machine because she's getting a big turb ski big a turbo, dude. which we means at yesterday. It's pretty big. she needs some head studs wait she where's needs... the turbo whoa whoa leo stop dude quit it or... stop it Psh, unbelievable dude leo, just want to see the turbo let's look at that side right? <laughs> where's the turbo Rich? i don't know oh, where's... See that? Ooh, wow, that's spring. a crazy spring, turbo. dude. That is not a turbo. Oh, okay. Right. Hold on. That is not a turbo either. This is a, a pile of goodies that Rich got me. Okay. So don't look at them. See that? Oh, oh, injectors, those. eh? These are head studs. <laughs> <laughs> is that funny? <laughs> I thought it was. Uh, all right, I'll see the good stuff. May or may not be. Man, nice bag. Good Big bag. blue, dude. Big adds up. Look that says N-I-C-K, Nick, baby. <laughs> uh, so that is a dynamite turbocharger from Evolution Power Sports. You know those guys. We run all their stuff. Hey, Nick Seuss, he's, he's going to have the chassis that's able to go bigger. He's going to need the power to allow him to go bigger, bigger. faster, faster. That swing set better. Jump. Swing set jump? Thing's scary. Dude. <laughs> what are these people doing? Dude, these people. They're crazy out there. So Open yeah, lots to do. So I'm gonna jump on head studs. We got to put a fuel pump in. We got to yep. do some clutching. We yep. got to put injectors in. Yep. We got to put the new turbo on. Yep. We got to put shocks on. We got to put new suspension yep. on. All that stuff's happening. Yep. A shocks here. So. Well, today. Shocks are coming today. Oh, nice. Dude. So. Doug, I hate to break the bad news. It's not just. The I don't. Just, I don't want bad news. <laughs> <What>? So. <laughs> All right. What? It's a head gasket job, Doug. That's coming on. Head gasket job. Okay, okay, okay. Remember this thing, dude, a couple times we've been out with it. A lot of times we've been out with it. She's just been cooking, you know. I do. Open up some freaking orifice openings in the motor. She goes for about 10 minutes. 10 minutes. A lot of air pressure built on. A lot of pressure. I do, I do vaguely remember discussing that it would be a good idea to put a gasket in. So, okay, fine. So, we'll take the head off. We'll put a new gasket in. You going to port it while it's on? Uh, yeah, yeah, for sure. No. Did you, uh, did you buy that CNC <laughs> machine from that used tool place? I'm you trying, Rich. Up? I'm trying. I'm trying, Rich. Please. Please. All right. Well. This is a long intro. This yeah, too long, intro, probably. Really too long. long. <laughs> so We're going to do a whole do video, today? one shot, <laughs> yeah. four hours. It's I hope you guys right are here, ready dude. for Put this. <laughs> You All guys right. want to see if we can lift the YXZ, dude? No, I'm cutting. Yeah. Right. I'm cutting. I'm, cu I'm, I'm cutting. <laughs> I'm I gotta get to work. All right. You're gonna hurt. Somebody's gonna hurt their back. So. It's already hurt. All right, let's do this.
Hey, Looks like this is going along pretty well. What kind of switch you got going on this thing? Good dog? Oh! Okay, do the math, dude. Razor, A pillars, lights, A pillar lights. Got it, dude. Ooh, open fuel pump. Rich, what's going on in here, buddy? So, for this big turbo kit, you need more fuel to make power. Just adds up science. So, we're putting an ADM 340 in this. Um, Dang. We're using pretty much all the big power units we have. So, good pump, high quality unit. Going in there, we're going to pump the gasoline out of this. Because she's going fully 85 life, just like a big power machine. <laughs> That's just what you do. <laughs> also, will be convenient when we go on this glamorous trip. Not gonna have to worry about finding 93. We're just gonna have drums on drums of the 85. I like that. Mega rain. I like that. Well, Doug, what's going on back here, buddy? Man, we got the uh, the head off. Just cleaned up the uh, deck on the cylinders and checked them. Checked it for flatness. It's nice and flat, so good to go there. Gonna finish cleaning that. Go clean the head up. Check, make sure it's flat, and then bolt stuff back together. Dang, how's the head look? Let's go look at it, man. I don't see nicer looking things. Uh, okay. <laughs> We've seen better heads. <laughs> I've seen. I've seen. I've seen better things. This uh, sucker has unfortunately seen uh, a lot of heat yep. due to some circumstances. So there's some gummy oil in there, but honestly, everything looks fine. All the journals look fine. Buckets are all still moving good. Wear looks good. So surface looks good as well. Yeah, we'll clean it all up nice. It does. It did look like that uh, the head gasket was leaking. So hmm. probably in one of the times that it was severely overheated. You know, things moved a little bit. Head gasket wasn't doing that great, so she should be nice and tight when we go back together, though. I will clamp the heck out of it and, you know, you know do the deal. All right, hey, good work, dudes. Keep going. Updates. Make the world a better place. Work has happened. So, back here, engine, back together. She's Boom. got the big bad head studs in her. Doug her torque down to big bad torque. She's all reassembled. Wrong, Brian Crower, Run BC. Oh yeah, I remember that. Hooked guy. us up on the head stud. So obviously, normally we would get our head studs from Evo. There were some low stock concerns, so uh, Run BC hooked it up big time, man, with some big dogs. Those were 625 studs, right? Wow, 625 studs. What does that mean? Motor, dude. <laughs> real high grade. There's one grade of head stud that's better than stock, and then there's another grade that's even better than that, and then there's another grade, <laughs> another grade. which is 625. Another, three other ones. Real and good head studs. Like so. A BC hand, hand movement. You got a little something for BC. You know the deal. <laughs> uh, so yeah, I think that thing is uh, basically ready to have the new turbo bolted to it. So that's pretty neat. Ooh, and pretty also, cool. we got uh, the shocks back for this bad got boy. The shocks back, you know. Turns goes in eventually. Turns out they were in uh, real bad shape. Pretty so much despair. After Nick Seuss just dropped this thing Dang, from painful. space. They literally said there was no nitrogen left in the uh, front shock. He had blown all the nitrogen out of the front. There was at least one bent shock shaft right. There were adjusters that were messed up. So basically, you just grenaded those shocks. So Good shock. Shock therapy did them up, got them burning right again. We just got to throw the springs back on. And uh, <laughs> yeah, we'll yeah, so. Throw the springs on. Did you show them the light bars, dude? On Is you in the light pads? Oh, oh, oh turn them on, yeah. Dude. Turn, them on. Light pads, dude. turn these bad boys on, the new pods, man. Key on. Hey. See it. Don't let this mess up the camera. <laughs> oh my gosh. Hey, check this out. Oh. oh. Alright, so you're gonna have lighting, you're gonna have suspension, you're gonna have power. So we're just gonna keep at it here. No excuse to not hit that swing shut jump. Be a fucking. Woo! Yeah, it's like a, like a super bike, dude. <laughs> hey, so far, man. Hey, so, super bike. Hey, so far, it's a super bike. Car. <laughs> okay, swing well. Set. He's hitting swing set. Okay, Just put it out there. Set. Supper. Okay, good guy. Hey, two weekends <laughs> from uh, December, what is it? 12. 12. 12? Come watch him hit the swing set jump. Phew. Why am I swing set? I hit it. I hit it. You hit it. Ah, uh, dude, my back. <laughs> my uh, back. All right, well, listen, things will happen, so yeah. back to work. Early the next morning. Okay, literally two seconds ago. Oh, he's gone. He heard us. Rich walks in. Nick goes, where is that truck? I literally checked all my watch. Where's that truck? And then I, we Boom. all looked up and what is right there? Yeah, we're leaving to go to Glamis in three days and Nick's car is still sans suspension. So it's like two sans days later. Sans much stuff, dude. Yeah. Like, there's still no turbo on it. There's no exhaust on it. There's a oh, lot of Oh, there's our boy, dude. There's our boy. Go get him. Go get him. Richard. 
Oh, hey, how you doing? Look at this, dude. What am I looking at? All the stuff. Who stacked this? Well, I stacked it. Uh, uh, the doors, sense. it was cold, I didn't care. I just threw stuff, these boxes were broken. I don't care. It's here, that's all that matters. What else is here, dude? One of those dogs right there. Oh! <laughs> Listen, dude, I don't you know. You should get the wider box. You should just pop the wider box uh, this open. This one's right here, tough break. Listen, I listened three days in a row. It was maybe more than that. Maybe more. Yeah, Rich, uh, need some three-piece wheels, Rich. Uh, rich, uh, We're talking like every 15 minutes. Here, rich? We're talking every 15 minutes. My sides hurt so bad because Rich kept poking me. Here's the deal. Stop talking to me. The Shut three up. Three-piece wheels are here from Sandcraft going on 168. Let's see. I'm going to start calling you Little Rich, dude. You get all the nice stuff. You get more nice stuff than me. Let's see. Oh, oh, you're oh. not ready for it. Oh. <laughs> you're not ready for it. <laughs> do this. Do this. Oh, Douglas. Oh my gosh. Oh my. Oh brother. Dude. You guys have outdone yourselves. <laughs> Doug's doing some math real quick in his head. He said, oh, <laughs> Doug, I, I can't. I we mean, can't, dude. I'm done with. I'm done with those Pro Armor wheels, dude. Those things were the man. worst ever, dude. I like ramen noodles. It's no big deal. <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna be a six in it. This is gonna be this is a front tight. But these on twelve paddle demons, I'm gonna freaking rip. rip. Demon. Hey, demon. Man, it's gonna be. Uh, it's gonna be a fast machine. So we've got the wheels, we got all the other stuff over there. That sucker's ready to go. I think me and Nick Seuss are gonna get cranking on that thing. It's well, time to get. There's a lot of work to do, so. It's time to get! Hey! Get. I appreciate you. Y'all better get, but appreciate you as well. Appreciate you, dude. 24 hours later. What are you looking for? Exhaust gasket, dude. I think it was in that white Hey, right there now. There you go. Hey, Dale. Listen, you guys are making some serious headway here. So, uh, we bought all new stuff from Polaris. Now, this is obviously a pretty expensive thing to do, but when you're building a car to get beat on the way Nick's car is going to get beat on, you just buy all brand new bushings. So, in my opinion, Polaris has the best bushings. Like, they're O ring sealed, they pound into the arm, they stay real tight. And uh, we got all new bushings for every pretty much front moving piece on the every suspension. And not only that, the Nick Seuss has got, I think, <laughs> I don't know what you're doing there. I don't know you're if I like it. You're it, dude. There's some burrs. I'm trying to unburr it, dude. <laughs> Let's talk about these ball joints quick. These things are all What are those? Tight. These are Kellers. These are the biggest dogs maybe there are. Okay, so what's the difference between a stock and a Keller? Well, let me demonstrate that for you. Okay. So, you have your regular... Whoop de do here, right? A little ball joint, yep. Normal. Very standard piece. Yep. It's not standard. Oh. Okay. So instead of pressing in. Oh, and they're then... still pressed. Oh, they're still pressed. Yes. So you have your ring right here. So it's, it's, so still it's serviceable. Pressed. Okay. Yeah. Yep. This is still pressed. And then you have this that just slides right in here. And then this is fully adjustable as well. So, like this, you know, you clamp the sucker on right here. So do you want to grease that before you put yeah, it all together? Yeah. Yep. Okay. I'm just I'm just trying to get everything in order here. And so this like, this did, dictates the yeah the stiffness. Oh, the, the lash on that. Yeah. Interesting. Which so how tight do you make it? Pretty neat. Uh, it gives you uh, it gives you what you need to be at. And then instructions. I haven't gotten that far. And it's got boots for over here, I'd imagine. Yeah, the boots go right on there. I mean, Sweet. it's just a it's a big girdle. Yeah. But I mean, these, if you compare these to the stock ones, I mean, there's no comparison. The stock ones are la laughably bad. Like, I've never enjoyed that design on these. Yeah. And they failed me in the past. Like, the, I just, I mean, if that failed, it would probably fail this whole arm. <laughs> yeah. So what's good about the Polaris arms is from the factory, these are 120 wall means, so they're 0.12 inches thick, and they are beefy girls. They're so. beefy. Like, these things are <laughs> awesome. Like, yeah. I keep, you know, a lot of people keep saying, why don't you get, like, you know, why don't you get HCR or whatever? All the things. Like, I have beaten the hell out of these every single time I've ridden in this machine, and they have never, ever said, 
I'm sorry. They, never, <laughs> they, they just keep going. They keep, just going, keep going, taking going. the beating. I didn't actually change the rear trailing arms because they're perfect. Yeah. I mean, I repainted them with some really nice Krylon paint. <laughs> grill paint. It wasn't grill paint, dude. But anyways, like those things are stout. Like there's really no reason to change those. The front ones, like I did have some cracks in the paint, like on uh, the shock towers. Yeah, but you, you were know, jamming those yeah, into the ground I mean, a million times. Things that you should would normally never do, but like these, the OEM stuff is perfect for me. Yeah, so those Kellers mixed with OEMs, dude. I think this sucker. <laughs> good combo. It's gonna be tight. It's gonna be real tight. Unfortunately, I pressed these on wrong well, twice, so you know, I'm running around about three hours of sleep. I ain't doing so hot. Hey, you you live and learn. Pretty Stop watching. <laughs> He's watching Undertaker documentaries, and so I believe Rich is back here getting the uh, big old turbo put on. Is that true? Yeah, it's going really good back here. Everything's going together smooth. We got the turbo on. Just letting some unbelievable. Letting some oil chill in there. Okay. Free luber for the fire up. We got to change the oil in it because we had the head gasket off. Some coolant got in the crankcase. We don't want to run it with that. Big problems there. But yeah, everything's going super smooth back here, and. Uh, Excited to fire this hog up. It's gonna yeah. be pretty sweet. This thing's gonna rip. So you guys might not know this, the back end of this car is super, uh, super well. Some of the newer subscribers, but Doug and I actually went through and kind of created our own bed delete. So we made all these cuts with like a sawzall thing and then remounted the rear light and then remounted the rear camera below here. And uh, it's kind of like a unique bed delete. You can still access everything to work on it. And uh, it turned out really nice. And man, the wrap job turned out nice too. Good work, dudes. Rich wrap. Rich wrap. Pat and Penny. Well, I Look guess. Look for uh, it in your local stores. Pet Boys, AutoZone. Jenny's Party Store. Jenny's party store. <laughs> yeah. Twisted House of Glass. Twisted House of Glass. Seuss's. Big uh, Hogs. <laughs> Seuss's hogs Car only. Wash, dude. Oh, hogsonly.com. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so good work, dudes. Looking forward to you seeing see that too? Together. Oh, oh, no. you see that clutch, clutch too? Oh, no. Come on, man. Oh, my gosh. Is that new cover from ZRP? So change the weights. Oh, change really? Change the spring. Yep. Wow. Different cover. I mean, that's, I mean, it looks pro, you know, it's no tuner. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's pro setup. That's going to be awesome. This thing's going to, as uh, Rick would say, this thing's going to rock. Yeah, it's going to be very fast. <laughs> yeah, big thanks to ZRP. They really yeah, hooked this they machine really up. They really did. Got their arms on the back. Yeah, did you see that? that you got yeah, the towel, oh, yeah. their tie rods, got everything. Good dudes over there. Check hey, them good out. dudes. Check them out. Yeah, ZRP. Dude. I'm wearing their hat too. Check it out. ZRP. Where's no, that? he is. I'm wearing their ZRP. underwear. You guys don't want to see that. <laughs> let's do Let's just see. check them out real quick. <laughs> All right, boys, amongst many things happening in this garage right now, it's finally time to, well, I don't know, complete the saga of Joe Dirt. Just kidding. Project 268. Okay, so. It's ready to start. Well, hold on before you start it. Let's just talk about what happened. Uh, uh, engine wise, stuff. everything. Engine wise, so it's got a new turbo on it, the Evo Dynamite Turbo. It's on E85. Dang. 270 horsepower. Dang. Um, got some new charge tubes Ooh. on there. We put a new head gasket on it because the old one was blown because it was overheated several times. Uh, Giant, big dog yeah. head studs. There you go. Um, man, fresh exhaust wrap, courtesy of yours truly, fat and bending. Uh, new clutch kit. A lot of cleanup. Next we spent about two hours. Wild wire brushingless exhaust shocker. Um, but yeah. Beware of the dog, dude. Beware of the dog. <laughs> I'll right. give you guys one guess. Let's hear, let's hear the bark, dude. <coughs> Come on, baby. Oh, she wants to go. There she is. Idols, no problem. Right out of the gate with a humongous change. It's got new injectors, all new tuning, new turbo, looking beautiful. I'm glad you went with black here. No more pink charge tubes. Yeah, that pink was. That pink stinks, dude. I don't feel anywhere. They were back. <laughs> they were a bit. A little longer than a few minutes later. What the f is going on out here? All right, do it again. Oh, you missed it, bro! <laughs> what happened? Oh, dude, that's, you need it scared that. me, dude. Yeah, it scared me. <laughs> Just editing like a normal human. It sounded like there's gunshots in the garage. <laughs> Cars, oh man. 
Oh Get me God. out of here, Rich. Woo! Next to us is just done jumping. He's like going to two step all the time now. He's going to be cruising around just hitting it. Oh, it adds up. No. It adds up. You should see those up. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's time for a test drive. I drove this thing out from the garage to here. It felt like a brand new vehicle. That's good. That's Mostly good because here. it is a brand new vehicle. <laughs> I mean, there's not much that's not new on this thing. So. The frame and the roll cage in the plastics. Other Everything else, that, new. That's brand new. Like, I mean, we went through everything. Like, it drives so nice, dude. Say it enough. And one thing that we might not have covered a lot too is we did put a Sandcraft drive line in this thing prior. Prior, yeah. So, uh, the last time I uh, cleaned some screwer here, I was doing some jumping and it pretty much just let go. So, I mean, she's fully set up. If this doesn't work, we're crashing into the pond and that's where, that's where she'll stay, dude. Wow, aggressive. Well, let's see this thing rip, brother. All right, man, appreciate you. Another small change too is that uh, we went to D3s instead of the Pro Armors that were in there. So we've all trusted our lives with these Simpson D3s for a long time. Nick got all the Pro Armor stuff when he got the car two years ago. Now, Simpson time. Okay, you ready? Woo! You ready? Just give her the beans. All right, give her one run then. Let's see this thing. I don't think we've ever rebuilt a car more than that. Looks very nice to see it back out, man. Yeah. And I don't hear it rattling from 100 feet away, so already a success. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. But yeah, fully done up. Hate to keep harping on it, but basically, it. basically a brand new car. Looks really fast. Sounds really good so far. Just, has to be yeah, it's really cold. It's like 31 degrees right now. A lot of dust, heavy dust. <laughs> I think it did like a small wheelie. <laughs> did I see that? Don't surprise me, that thing's got the juice. Wow. Heck yeah. Good unit. I mean. Sounds like it's running good, so that's my takeaway here. It sounds like the CF1 because it basically is the same. Yeah, it's the <laughs> same exact setup. It's the yoked version of the CF1. Pretty much. I'll get Nick's hair blowing in the wind. <laughs> How's it feel? I know you like that launch. Okay. Maybe just let it idle for a second. How do you feel about it? Really good. Just feels good. Does it drive straight? Yeah, it actually drives straight. Steering wheel straight or yeah. needs some adjustment? No, the steering wheel straight. Really? So yeah, we actually adjusted quite a bit of stuff. So these were blown out, so we cut, uh, <laughs> drilled these <laughs> drilled these out, re, uh, reworked them, and then uh, everything's straight. But... Big dog. Big dog. Nick, why don't we take a second just to thank the people that were involved in uh, getting this thing done. So, huge thanks to ZRP. They came through with a lot of really, really good stuff. The radius rods, the tie rods, I mean, we went over those, those tie rods are freaking pro. Uh, huge thanks to Evo, like that stuff. Like this thing is gonna run so good again. Um, big turbo, all the blow off stuff, the freaking all, all the goodies. Right. All the goodies. Uh, thank to uh, Keller. <laughs> yeah, thanks, for Keller, making for making a real cool ball. <laughs> selling them for MSRP to your boys. So yeah, I think uh, not in this video. Maybe in a different one. Maybe uh, across the country, we'll see this thing rip for the first time, and it's yeah. going to be so fast. I think it's going to be. She's going to go. Like it. Yeah. I don't think you're ready for a hundred extra horsepower. I don't think I understand that. I mean, I had a taste in the freaking. I had to taste in the RS1, and as soon as I got out of that thing, I'm like, I've been doing this all wrong. <laughs> especially for Dunin, man. There's just nothing like that, man. Yeah, you can't have too much power, especially out in Glamis. Like, when we were in Oklahoma, it's like, okay, you know, maybe 250 is a good amount. But in Glamis, some of those bowls, yeah, you, want, you could have yeah. 500. You want as much power as you possibly have out there. 
thanks for thanks to Rich for getting me all the stuff. Yeah, man. Rich and Doug spent a boatload oh, of time on this, and you. Oh, and the sandcraft too, man. Oh yeah, uh, sandcraft some wheels. Freaking, uh, wheels for you. You'll see that one. It's all. Let's just check those out real quick while they're this thing's in here. Yet. We'll do it in a second. They're once they're done mounted. It's like an outro though. Okay, yeah. You know the deal. Come on. You Been taking videos deal. for a long time. It seems like. <laughs> So our friend Calvin, thank God, is over here busting his ass. These are it, Sandcraft. That's Nemesis, right? These are, uh... Right? Ne Nemesis, no, right, Rich? These are, uh, Nexus. 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 My bad, dude. Nemesis is a good name, Nexus too. Feel free to their, steal that. Uh, this is gonna be a... Build name, though. We should probably build those ourselves. Yeah, we're building Nemesis. Nemesis! Yeah, don't steal it. I said you could steal it, but anyway. Don't steal it. Yeah, don't steal it. Yeah, so this is gonna be... This is gonna be awesome. So not only are you upgrading from those really crappy, heavy pro armors, so which we're now running yeah, on the Buffalo. The but straight up. Those were a regular wheel that shouldn't have gone on a pedal. Somehow they're still on something. They're good, whatever. But this is gonna be awesome. This, this is pro. This is gonna look so good. Super pro. It's come a long way. Appreciate you. So we'll see it moving in a little bit. Yep. But this is the outro for right now. So okay. buddy. Hey, appreciate it. Thank you guys for watching more than anything. Thank you guys so much for subscribing more than anything, more than even that. Thank you guys for donating because without that, like we wouldn't be able to do this stuff at all. So thanks for buying parts from Rick. Yeah, keeps seriously. Him, keeps them young, keeps them fresh. Look at him. Look at that smile. <laughs> Look at that guy over there. That's worth that? at least 35, 40 bucks. Freshly trimmed beard too. Just wow. a good guy. Look at that guy. Hey, just a good guy. Give us your best pose. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, so oh yeah, god. thank you guys more than anything cuz we'd just be ripping 900s still. Still, if it weren't for you guys. So <laughs> Hey, we'll see you at the dunes. It's going to be tight. Okay, check see that you. out. Hey, take care. Uh, see you around. Uh, hold on, check this out. Dang. <laughs>